fica nem pausa, né? Fica usando, né? Ah, yeah, I mean, our start was poor. Um, or we didn't have the level of uh, intensity that we, we wanted, and Cooper changed that uh, again. Uh, so he's playing at a very high level. And uh, I mean, how many minutes he played, but that's probably for him his best game for 30 minutes. Um, yeah, is there any, uh, like, his last couple of games, Cooper's really picked it up, it seems. Is that anything in training that's turned around for him, or is he? Uh, he's just a pest at training. <laughs> <laughs> he's always been, uh, he's been working very hard. Mm -hmm. um, he was down on confidence probably a month ago. Um, but, you know, he's, uh, he's done very well. Mm -hmm. So, uh, you know, all credit to him. Jerry, another big uh, performance for you today. It seems like a growing game after game. Today was dominance of both ends of the court. Are you, are you feeling settled? Did you, was that your best performance today? Um, I'm not sure, but. I know, uh, you know, working with Lewis in the post and everything, uh, getting used to, to uh, you know, how he plays and feeding off him really um, helps, helps everyone's game. Um, so I'll, I'll credit to him, you know, my teammates. Yeah, that's very nice of you to say. But, uh, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, it seems to me there's a lot more self-belief in your game. Uh, you're powering through a lot more. The dunks are becoming a bit more frequent. You're taking more shots. Feeling a bit more confident about yourself, it certainly looks that way on the court. Right? Yeah, yeah, I feel that way. Um, I mean, honestly, like from the beginning of the game when I when they were done with jewels and I got a few easy dunks, that's I think that's when I felt like you know um, I should assert myself a little bit more. There were plays earlier in the season where you were sort of trying to dunk over people where you were a real stretch. And has it been, was that a thing working with jewels to get those passes happening in the post? The, the yeah, yeah we, we practiced that a lot. Um, you know, we, we practice uh, on different offenses and defenses, and, uh, and you know, we, we did that, uh, you know, scouting goal coast and things. So, so um, the coaching staff really got us used to, to how they would play defense on us, and I think that helped the game uh, a lot. How important was it to keep uh, Worthington relatively quiet? I know he still plays at the highest points for the Blaze today, but were you pleased with how uh, you know you handled him defensively today? I thought Tolly down the stretch did a great job on him. <coughs> you know, we uh, we were surprised with their starting group, uh, so we had to make some adjustments. But then they came back with a bigger group, and uh, so when, when we were more settled in our uh, matchups, you know, Tolly did a good job. He, he got a number of intercepts. Uh, he drew a very important charge, and he, you know, he worked pretty hard. Now, for a rookie against a you know strong veteran, I, I thought Tolly did, did pretty well. I mean, in terms of uh, the uh, the game, in terms of the rest of the season, how, how big is this victory? How big can this victory be going into the stretch now? Um, we've been under a lot of pressure. There's still a lot of commentary that it's not a, a team that probably hasn't fulfilled its potential, but we're we're getting there, and uh, we're working on a, a mantra that we're working for the front of the shirt, not for the back of the shirt. And I thought you would say that tonight. I take my hat off to the players. Um, my coaching staff did a good job, um, and uh, it's it's one game, but we've got a bit of wind in our sails. I mean, we go to Townsville, we owe Townsville, we owe that stupid crocodile and air gun up, and uh, we'll be ready to play up there. And there's a lot of belief in our club. So we're going to make today.